what is up this year la in a minute and if you've been out after dark recently you've noticed these blue and purple tinted street lights no this is not a filter the street lights are actually purplish and bluish in some but not all areas in los angeles so i know that's normal but i wanted to know is that intentional is it safe what's going on with these purple street lights let's get into it so let's get this straight. The purple or blue tinted street lights are not intentional. And even though it's a pretty nice color, it could actually be dangerous. The lack of blue sensitive cones at the center of our retina make it difficult to see blue and violet saturated light and worsens people's ability to see the details. This can make it difficult to distinguish between colors and everything could become a shade of blue or even black. And here's the thing, this is not a Los Angeles only problem. This is happening nearly everywhere in the United States. This is a shot from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Here's a picture from Florida, and this is in Illinois. So what is going on? Well, American cities started switching their streetlights from sodium lamps to LEDs about 15 years ago, which changed the color of many nighttime streetlights from yellowish orange to bright white. And not only are LEDs brighter and make things easier to see, but they're one of the most energy efficient lighting technologies that exist. But the way the LEDs are made is one of the reasons why these street lights may end up turning purple. And while we see the white light of the LED street lights, it's actually blue LEDs coated with a type of fluorescent substance called phosphor. So when the blue LED light goes through this layer, the phosphor absorbs some of the blue wavelengths and spits out different ones that appear to the eye to be white light. So what appears to be happening is that the phosphor is degrading over time. As it flakes off and there's less phosphor to convert light, more of the core LED color, the blue, is visible. And as the phosphor continues to degrade, the bulb just projects the bluish purple light by itself. Now there's no precise cause as to why the phosphor layer is degrading or delaminating. It could be caused by heat buildup inside the light fixture because of constant operation, vibrations from passing cars, or even gravity tugging downward on the phosphor layer. Now in Long Beach, the only city for which I could find data, they say the issue is affecting perhaps 15% of the streetlights and officials are working on replacing the purple bulbs as quickly as possible. But in Los Angeles, as of now, officials haven't mentioned what they are doing, so we're just gonna watch as these streetlights continue to turn purple. So the purple and blue streetlights are definitely not something that was set out intentionally by the city or any other entity, but it looks like they're here to stay, at least for the time being. Until they're changed into normal colored streetlights, drive safely, Los Angeles. All right, LA, it's been a minute.